Hundreds of people are expected to gather in just hours, all wanting you to know what will be done about a tent encampment in a Chicago park. We are listening to you and your concerns about your park and the people who have nowhere to go. CBS News Chicago investigator Dave Savini joins us now from Gompers Park. Dave? Uh, Jim and Erica, the garbage cans that are overflowing behind me is just one problem. There's drug paraphernalia and other unsanitary conditions here at Gompers Park. That has the neighborhood up in arms, and they're demanding the city find homes and services for the people living in these tents. We started out with probably three or four tents a year ago, and now we were up to 27. You are looking at a small village of 27 tents set up in Chicago's Gompers Park. The people who live in the neighborhood that borders this park say trash is usually all over the ground here because the few garbage cans the city has provided cannot handle the volume. We've been hearing a lot of complaints from the community of concerns of the park being devastated by the tents growing here. Gail Bites is with the Restore Gompers Park Coalition and her organization has been trying to get the city, specifically the mayor's office, to move these tents out of their local park. We want to get these people help. We want them to be able to live in dignity. Um, to be living in squalor and unsanitary conditions is un unacceptable for a city of Chicago. And I understand that the, they're using the, um, the park district, the water. Yes, yes, the yes. In. Yeah, they're using the bay to do their clothing, wash their dishes. They've also used it as a bathroom facility. She says it's gotten so bad the park district had to turn off the water here. The people who live in the neighborhood around here don't want these tents simply torn down. They want the city to provide brick and mortar homes for these people and wraparound services like mental health services and help for addictions. The addiction is, you know, yeah. it's, a, it's a big problem too, you know. This woman says she moved to Chicago from Poland 20 years ago, had a good job, but then her life fell apart and she ended up here in a tent for the last year. So if the city were able to find the money to find housing for you and the others, on a heartbeat. you would do it in a heartbeat? On a heartbeat. Okay. No question. Today, I'll leave everything behind and I go. What message do you want to send to the mayor? Mayor, we need help. We're pleading for you. And what has the mayor's answer been? We don't have the money. The same thing happened at Humble Park and the city is finding homes for those people who live there. Residents who live in this neighborhood say, why can't they do that here too. A meeting is set with the city's director of homelessness at 7 p.m. at the Salvation Army Church. Uh, that's the building right behind me, right next to these tents. I'm Dave Savini in Gompers Park. Back to you. Dave, thank you.